Volma runs third. The treasure route, the N12, runs through the area. Diamonds are mined here, but there are no visible signs of development. There is high youth unemployment in the area. These young people from Borubalo are battling the odds. To break through that circle of people who deal in diamonds because they've known each other, they've trusted each other. So you need to have that kind of trust to be able to uh, be one of them. What is happening around our area? The illegal diamond, what, what, that are happening. So I just sat down with my grandfather and then explained everything to him. And then he just gave me a go ahead. They have been trained in the art of cutting and polishing diamonds. Government believes this initiative will help develop the local economy. This project is one of the catalytic pro projects that we think that it can grow, it can change, it can make changes to, to, the, to the people, it can create job opportunities and can create also as well permanent jobs. The Borubalo project is seen as a solution to illicit diamond trade in the area and it now employs six young people under a watchful eye of a mentor. On a scale from zero to ten, or on a scale to ten, um, I will give the guys anything from seven to eight at the moment. I'm, I'm very happy with the whole staff in the office as well. This first of its kind beneficiation initiative aims to set this impoverished community on the road to real development and economic growth. Solo Feloma TBAD, SABC News, Volmaran Start.